Here's how you subtract mixed numbers when you can keep your whole numbers as a separate problem and then you just subtract your two fractions. All right, if you're not used to converting to mixed numbers, here is another alternative to solving the problem. So I do five minus two is to become three. And I'm just gonna kind of keep that to the side as I work on subtracting my fractions. So I do three fourths minus three sixteenths. Again, these denominators are not the same, so I need to multiply. What I get is 12 sixteenths minus three sixteenths, which becomes nine sixteenths. Then I go and look, can I go ahead and simplify that problem any further? And my answer is no. My final solution now is three and nine sixteenths. And that is how, when you want to subtract mixed numbers, but you want to com not convert them to mix, um, to improper fractions, you can simply just subtract your, your whole numbers and then work with your fractions and combine them together.